Dear Uncle Locust, There still has been no news about the missing chimpanzee. However, I was given some hope these past few weeks as it was announced that the marketplace has officially opened. So far, there is only one vendor who set up shop there, but hopefully more will come. If it expands a lot, I am sure someone will have some information, even if it is just a hunch. I'll keep you posted on any news I am able to find. I do have some good news this time around, though. After we cleared out the woods for the house, it did not take long for the ground to become solid enough for us to lay the foundation for the house. From there, we were able to get the supports up quite easily. Unfortunately, a winter came which kind of complicated some things, but we were able to continue working on the good days and finish the walls and the roof before spring came around. Once we had a few good days of dry weather and the ground could harden up some, I was able to get a nice hedge planted all around the porch and got the path started from the house. Spring also brought some new animals to the farmstead. Leleth, one of the people who came on this expedition with us, was kind enough to donate a chocobo to get the farm started. Then I was really lucky to find a mate for it while I was out exploring. I am super excited to see where this takes me, as there are rumors that you can breed the chocobos to a point where you can get a rare one which allows you to fly. Can you imagine it? I can't wait to get the bridge in place and get started on the animal housing. For now though, the two lovely chocobos are hanging out on the front lawn where I get to enjoy the lovely cooing while I work on the house. Speaking of the house, I am in desperate need of some furniture. The house looks so barren right now. I have a local artisan coming in to work on the kitchen as that really needs to be the first thing up and running. However, I am at a complete loss for what to do for the rest of the rooms. Do you have any contact information for Cousin Ladybug? She always had such lovely furniture and I would really like to see if I could commission some pieces from whomever she uses. If you don't have the contact information for her, any kind of information on who to talk to would be great. After I get the kitchen in place, I plan on setting up an area for the hives close to the farmhouse. Then I should be able to get the bridge set up to the animal area. Hopefully we can get all of this done before the next winter, as I really want to make sure that the chocobos have a nice place to bed down when the weather starts getting super cold again. I'm sorry that this letter is shorter than the others so far. So much has been going on with the house, I have not had much time to do much else. I hope the little ones are doing well and give my regards to Aunt Locust. I miss you all so much and I look forward to seeing you soon. Love, Mantis. If you're new to the channel, click the Mantis icon to subscribe, then hit the bell button to get notified when I put out additional content. Want to check out more of my videos? Try the one on the left, or you could check out the playlist on the right. That's it for now, but I'll see you guys in the next episode.